Welcome to this intermediate level of the Windows Server 2025 video series. In this video, we will cover Windows Server Data Center Edition and its features in a little more depth than the foundation level video, providing more information about the features, but not in technical detail. The topics covered in this module are shown here. These will help you with initial sales conversations, especially when discussing upgrades or infrastructure refresh plans with customers. Note that the key features of Windows Server 2025 that differ from Windows Server 2022 and the associated benefits are discussed in the advanced module in this series. Windows Server 2025 Data Center is the most complete edition with unique product features that are not available within Standard or Essentials editions. There are many features and functions that are in common with Windows Server Standard. Both have the core Windows Server functionality and can use the Windows Admin Center for management and security. However, Windows Server Data Center is based around the capabilities and features aimed at more virtualized environments. It has advanced features for virtualization, storage, and networking. Let's take a look at the more advanced features in more detail. Microsoft Storage Spaces Direct is a solution for software-defined storage, included without cost in Windows Server Data Center with high availability enabled by Microsoft Storage Spaces Direct, data is protected from a server failure and can be recovered quickly. It enables customers to combine internal storage drives on a cluster of between 2 and 16 physical servers to create a software-defined pool of storage. With the Windows Server Data Center Edition, there are software-defined storage enhancements. These can enable users to save up to 60% of storage for file servers, save up to 90% of storage for virtual hard disks, ISO files, and backups. And it simplifies procurement, deployment, and infrastructure management. Windows Server Data Center uses APIs to communicate with the underlying hardware infrastructure to direct traffic on a network. This enables networks to be configured centrally and simplifies network management. Some of the key deciding factors in choosing Data Center Edition rather than the Standard Edition is the capacity requirements for VMs, the number of storage volumes, and the data size for replication. While Windows Server 2025 Standard Edition is limited to two VMs, the Data Center Edition is unlimited. There is the ability to add VM capacity to the Standard Edition, but it is more economical to purchase the Data Center Edition if the requirement is for six VMs or more. Windows Server 2025 Standard Edition supports replication of a single volume. A replicated volume can be up to two terabytes in size, whereas Windows Server 2025 Data Center Edition allows replication of an unlimited number of volumes with no size limit on replicated volumes. Storage Replica is Windows Server technology that enables replication of volumes between servers or clusters for disaster recovery. It is included in both Standard and Data Center editions. But the Standard Edition is limited to one partnership and one resource group with a single 2 terabyte volume, while Data Center is unlimited. Windows Server 2025 offers many benefits to your customers. Let's take a look at some of these that address specific customer objectives. Customers looking to modernize their IT infrastructure might consider deploying Windows Server 2025 on the latest HPE ProLiant servers to provide additional layers of security. They might require secured core server solutions that use HPE hardware, firmware and operating system capabilities to protect against current and future threats. Customers can also get best-in-class performance, scalability and availability for business-critical workloads like Microsoft SQL Server on Windows Server 2025. 
while the modern containerized platform can help with building more secure, reliable and powerful apps. Microsoft Hyper-V is included with Windows Server 2025 and uses a familiar user interface that reduces the learning curve. Increased scalability with larger virtual machines supporting 240 terabytes of RAM and 2048 virtual processors. Customers can manage virtualization with Windows Admin Center, a locally deployed browser-based advanced toolset for hybrid and on-premises server management at no additional cost. Windows Admin Center uses HPE ILO to provide direct visibility to server-level inventory and diagnostic information used to monitor, manage and troubleshoot server infrastructure. Windows Server 2025 enables remote users to run applications and desktops, so users can work effectively from places that are safe and convenient for them. Customers can enable secure remote work with enhanced Windows Defender capabilities, secure virtualization, and streamlined access and identity management. Many customers have some a hybrid cloud strategy, so it is important to offer them solutions that help them strengthen business continuity and disaster recovery. They may wish to improve uptime and productivity with cloud-based disaster recovery and backup capabilities. Windows Server 2025 helps them to maximize their IT team's time and productivity with centralized unified server administration through Windows Admin Center, which allows them to integrate on-premises server with Azure in just a few clicks. As an example, Azure services can be used to deploy or move Windows Server 2025 virtual machines directly in Azure for simplified server management with monitoring, logging and reporting. Customers can choose between factory pre-installed and non-pre-installed licenses. The benefit of factory pre-installed licenses is that they come with complete integration and testing with preliminary setup being done by HPE engineers on request. The non-pre-installed factory OEM licenses, also referred to as drop-in box licenses, are available with new HPE servers for customers choosing do-it-yourself installations. HPE offers ready-made configurations for the SMB market covering the most common workloads and requirements such as database, small-scale virtualization, small office setup, backup and recovery, remote workers and powering AI. The specific configurations may differ according to GEO and many are available through the HPE Smart Choice program so that they are based on heat of the market needs are quick to ship and provide a simple purchase process with the best price first time. These configurations include fully configured HPE ProLiant servers and for certain workloads, HPE storage and networking as well with all the server options that are needed for the specific workload. They also include the suitable Windows Server 2025 license. Let's take an example of a customer that has a database workload. Common use cases include CRM, inventory management, accounting and financial management, and e-commerce platforms. They may have a large volume of data that they wish to manage centrally and yet are concerned about security. Typical customers include single-site businesses or businesses with remote offices and branch offices with up to perhaps 100 users. The HPE SMB solutions, including those purchased using the HPE Smart Choice program, include the Windows Server standard license. CALs would be needed to be added to them separately. In some regions, there are HPE Smart Choice solutions that contain HPE ProLiant ML350 or DL380 servers with Microsoft Windows Server 2025 standard and five user CAL packs as a single SKU. HPE Smart Choice solutions do vary between regions and will change over time, so look out for more solutions that include Microsoft Windows Server 2025 standard and CalPaks. 
the HPE Smart Choice program enables partners to get a quote in minutes so that they can order the most popular configs in a single SKU. The fast, predictable shipping is great for both customers and partners, who can then have more selling time. More detail on the current configurations can be found in HPE Seismic. Search for the HPE Smart Choice briefcase for supporting collateral. HPE Window Server Reseller Option Kit or Rock Licensing gives customers a one vendor solution for their server and operating system. Note that the HPE Rock licenses are the same Windows Server 2025 licenses that are available directly from Microsoft, but with added benefits. Purchasing the server and OS together is often the most cost-effective option and less expensive than acquiring them separately. They are designed, fully tested, validated and certified for the HPE server of choice. In addition, they come with free 90 days HPE online or telephone support, which means a one-stop support using the same contacts for both the operating system and the server. Rock offers a lower acquisition cost that helps you to better manage inventory. HPE partners can stock and sell Rock licenses as needed, helping to manage inventory. Revenue can be increased with more attach opportunities for CALs. Server options, installation and configuration services can all be added to ensure customers get the most suitable IT solution with the convenience of one source shopping and support. Visit HPE Seismic for more information about Windows Server 2025 and licensing. HPE Seismic can be accessed via a direct link or from the HPE Partner Ready portal using your Partner Ready credentials. Just type Windows Server 2025 in the search box to find related collateral. You can now take the assessment that follows this module. Once complete, you will be ready to move the final video in this series, which focuses on addressing the needs of your SMB customers with combined solutions from Microsoft and HPE. Thank you.